Evening. Thanks for joining us for devotions again. Uh, we're going to continue our uh, Good Shepherd Sunday. Thank you. Good Shepherd Sunday theme with uh, number 709, The King of Love My Shepherd Is. The King of Love My Shepherd Is, whose goodness faileth never. I'm nothing lack if I am his, and he is mine forever. Where streams of living water flow, my ransom soul he With food celestial feeded, perverse and foolish oft I strayed, but yet in love he sought me. And on his shoulders gently laid, and home rejoicing brought me. In death's dark veil I fear no ill, with thee. at the end there, bud. <laughs> oh, okay. Sarah's going to plug the computer in, so that's where she went. Oh, stop that, please. We are going to have 1 Samuel chapter 8 for this evening. <clears throat> a little word to the wise, the uh, thick begins to plot in a little bit. When Samuel grew old, he appointed his sons as judges for Israel. The name of his firstborn was Joel, and the name of his second was Abijah. And they, they served at Beersheba. But his sons didn't walk in his ways. They turned aside after dishonest gain and accepted bribes and perverted justice. <laughs> so all the elders of Israel gathered together and came to Samuel at Ramah. They said to him, You're old, and your sons don't walk in your ways. Now appoint a king to lead us, such as all the other nations have. But when they said, Give us a king to lead us, this displeased Samuel. So he prayed to the Lord. And the Lord told him, Listen to all that the people are saying to you. It's not you that they've rejected, but they've rejected me as their king. 
as they've done from the day I brought them up out of Egypt until this day, forsaking me and serving other gods, so they're doing to you. Now listen to them, but warn them solemnly, and let them know what the king who will reign over them will do. Samuel told all the words of the Lord to the people who were asking him for a king. And he said to them, This is what the king who will reign over you will do. He will take your sons and make them serve with his chariots and horses, and they'll run in front of his chariots. Some he will assign to be commanders of thousands and commanders of fifties, others to plow his ground and reap his harvest, still others to make weapons of war and equipment for his chariots. He'll take your daughters to be perfumers and cooks and bakers. He'll take the best of your fields and vineyards and olive groves and give them to his attendants. He'll take a tenth of your grain and of your vintage and give it to his officials and attendants. Your men servants and maid servants and the best of your cattle and donkeys he'll take for his own use. He'll take a tenth of your flocks and you yourselves will become his slaves. When that day comes, you'll cry out for relief from the king you've chosen, and the Lord will not answer you in that day. But the people refused to listen to Samuel. No, they said, we want a king over us. Then we'll be like all the other nations with a king to lead us and go out before us and fight our battles. Then when Samuel heard all that the people had said, he repeated it before the Lord. The Lord answered, listen to them and give them a king. Then Samuel said to the men of Israel, Everyone go back to his town. O oh Lord, have mercy on us. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God. <clears throat> Ready to pray the evening prayer, George? You pray it with us, please. Close your eyes, bow your head, put your hands together. All right. I thank you, my Amen. Heavenly Father, through Jesus Christ, your dear Son, that you have graciously kept me this day. And I pray that you would forgive me all my sins where I have done wrong, and graciously keep me this night. For into your hands I commend myself, my body and soul and all things. Let your holy angel be with me, that the evil foe may have no power over me. Amen. What would you like to pray, pray to Jesus for today, George? Did we get to play in Daddy's truck today? No. That's okay. <laughs> Did we think about it today? What else do we do today? We play outside with the turkeys. Oh, get to play with the turkeys. Okay. And what did this bird do? Did it fly in the air? Oh. What did the bird do? Did it? Did he chase it? Or did it go up in the air? Did it spin, spin, spin? Something oh. like that? <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's pray. Should we pray for oh, the frisbee? Uh, and we'll ask Jesus to heal your hand too, huh? Uh, uh, okay. And my sandwich and the leaves and the carrots. Okay, let's uh, thank him for all those things. And the books. All right. And the candles. Okay. And, and the let's, books. Good boy. Okay, and let's bow our head and we'll close our eyes. Dear Jesus, thank you so much for the books and the candles and playing in Daddy's truck and playing outside, and playing with the frisbee, and for the carrots that we got to eat, and the leaves, and the sandwich, and everything else. We thank you for all the good things that you give to us, Lord, and uh, we ask that you would help us to enjoy them, oh. and to share them with the people I around us. We ask that you would please uh, heal George's hand of the uh, burn that's been bothering him, and uh, help him to feel all better real soon. We ask that you would heal everybody who's struggling with this coronavirus, Lord, and uh, heal our whole world of um, this pandemic and help us figure out how best to deal with it. Help us to be patient with each other as um, we try and figure out exactly how to live here. And uh, we'll just take away the whole thing from us, if you would, Lord. We ask that you would bless us the rest of this evening. Uh, give us a good night's rest and wake us up in the morning uh, ready to hit it hard Thanks. for your kingdom. All this we ask in your name, Lord Jesus. Amen. Mm -hmm. uh, pray our Father. You pray it for us, George. Ready? Our mm -hmm. Father. You say it with us. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses, 
as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. The Almighty and merciful Lord, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, bless us and keep us. Amen. God, from whom all blessings flow, Praise Him, all creatures here below. Praise Him above ye heavenly host. Praise Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Amen. And a boy. Well, thank you all for joining us this evening. Uh, we will catch you next time. Have a good one. <laughs>